जय सचिदानंद टोपियस ओए टोपियस कैन स्टॉप अस हियर सो दिस इज द अक्रम विज्ञान जर्मनी सत्संग Akram Vignan Jami Satsang of September 21st, 2014 on the Vyavasthit. This is the 29th session of Vyavasthit. Hey Naraji, Jai Satchidana. Jai Satchidana. What is the word to say? Okay. Okay. Now should I address these thoughts, right? Yes. Super. Okay. Das heißt, hier muss ich leise machen, richtig? Ja, ich mach mute. Ich, ich mute nachher alle gleichzeitig. Ist okay. okay, aber wir hören jetzt schon darüber und nicht über Ustream, richtig? Ja, also wie du willst. Du kannst darüber hören oder am besten ist darüber, sonst hast du doppelt Sound. Okay, super. I love this video from Shuddha. Shuddha Trash. Das ist schön, oder? Ja, es ist toll, ich verstehe kein Wort, aber oh, da will ich nur noch zum Lord und zum Gnani. Ja, ich weiß dann nichts anderes mehr. Absolut nicht. Ich musste ich gestern ausschalten, damit ich hier wieder meine Files setzen konnte. Ja. <lacht> Absolut nicht, so beautiful. Und auch die Bilder sind toll gemacht. Hat er echt also, toll gemacht. Ja, das ist so liebevoll, ne, das Video dazu, zu, dazu Ach, gestellt. Ja, absolut. Uwe da wir noch nicht auf Sendung sind, können wir eventuell morgen etwas später unser Meeting machen? Ja, klar, jederzeit. Das ist, das ist einfach, wenn ich Luft hier habe. Ja, genau. Ich habe nachmittags, am 2 habe ich einen Termin beim Zahnarzt, ansonsten ist alles fein. Okay, super. Nee, nee, es wird vorher. Ähm, irgendwie bist du wieder leise. Hab ich insgesamt leise? Wenn ich Input ganz Hoch ab. Jetzt ist es besser. Marion, Jason Zidane. Das höre ich. Mensch. Kannst du es laut machen, Uwe, ob du dann zeigst? Was? Video laut machen. Du kannst ja jetzt dein Licht dich muten und das andere laut machen für den Moment, bis wir anfangen. Jay Satchidanand. Jay Satchidanand. Okay, so that's not a bad. All right. Jay Satchidana. <laughs> Jay Satchidana. Jay Satchidana. <laughs> Jay Satchidana. Yeah, Jay Satchidana. Jay Satchidana. Yeah. Naraji. Jay Satchidana. Hmm. How are you? <laughs> <laughs> Such a beautiful song. I really love it. Wow. It's really so gorgeous. And also the pictures. He made a great, a great video. Yeah, I think he did a good job, yes. Both of you, it's amazing. Yeah. Now everybody wants the meanings, and so that will take another satsang. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but that's 
it's a it's another possibility to make another satsang out of it. Yeah, it it just just goes because the words are coming from some special place. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Now okay. Let's go. So we we still have some time, don't we? Yes, we have a few have minutes. A minute. Yes, we have a yeah. minute. So did we get everybody, did everybody get the code or was it just uh, because, you know, there is, you said there was a three missing. If I put Deepak boy, there is no extra three. No, you have three, three, three. You made only two threes. Oh. You but, missed one three. Oh, I see. What you wrote to me, what you wrote to me was only two threes. I see. Right, right. Three, three. All right, That's right. It. Okay, so three. now we'll, we'll let go of the beautiful music and we'll change into Shuddha. We'll need to see you when you, if you want. Oh, we'll just so leave it to the Lord. <laughs> leave it to the Lord. Okay, we'll leave it to the yeah. Lord. Oh, it's so beautiful. I don't want to let go. So, yeah, we can all be the seers of the video. That's all. Yes. This is so beautiful. But we can just take a moment. It's still, it's not that long. Huh? Shall we leave that for a second? Yeah, sure, that's fine. Okay. Um, it's so So, so, absolutely. Hey, there is such a thing. There is such a thing. Chidanand, uh, all the behind the in Chesa Chidanand to all Mahatmas in the, in the world who are online right now. This is a new project today, the new experiment. We are um, we are having Shuddha now in the conference in Sioux via Ustream, but so Shuddha has now the ability to be connected with us. So 
So, Shuda, wir haben heute das Experiment für euch, dass wir Shuda mit diesem, mit diesem Zoom, mit dem, neuen, ähm, mit dem neuen Medium Zoom haben. Für diejenigen von euch, die jetzt auf Ustream sind, die gerne dabei sein wollen, da habt ihr E-Mail e bekommen, da habt ihr die Infos und könnt euch einklicken. Ihr könnt euch auch telefonisch dazu, dazu reingehen, es gibt kein anderes Telefon mehr als dieses. Ähm, ich gebe trotzdem noch das Telefon und gebe die Infos weiter, falls da jemand drauf ist, aus Versehen. Weil du kannst dich hier auch direkt telefonieren. Und äh, was wir machen wollen, ist, dass wir jetzt dann gleich alle. Ohne auf Ustream, sorry für die Unterbrechung. Ohne auf Ustream, Moment, machen wir gleich. Ist jetzt ohne auf Ustream? Sorry. Ja, jetzt müsste Ton auf dem Stream sein. Sorry, ich habe beim Dings nicht eingestellt gehabt. Also nochmal, Chaser Chidanan für alle, die gerade jetzt reingekommen sind und keinen Ton hatten und dachten, was redet der vor sich hin? Ist jetzt der Ton zu hören? Ja. Okay, Chaser Chidanan, wir machen das Experiment heute mit Chuda auf diesem Zoom. Wer möchte von euch kann sich einklinken, telefonisch oder per Video und kann dabei sein. Ich übergebe jetzt an Shudder directly. So, für euch als Info, ihr habt oben rechts eine Möglichkeit, Gallery View zu machen. Das heißt, ihr könnt alle sehen, die da sind. Oder ihr könnt Speaker View machen. Dann seht ihr immer nur die beiden Sprecher, nämlich Susanne als Übersetzerin und Shudder. Und, und ansonsten die anderen oben bleiben. Wie ihr das wollt, könnt ihr selber eigentlich. Okay? So, um, shall we sing the three mantra together, Shudder? Yes. Let's do that. Also dann kommt alle online und macht, wenn, unmutet euch und ich mute euch dann später von, von hier aus und schalte dann nur Schuda und Susanne frei. Dann singen wir gemeinsam mit jemandem. Mhm. Mhm. Oh. 
Jai Satchidanand, Jai Satchidanand. Jai Satchidanand, Shudhatma Bhagavan, everyone. We begin this satsang of September the 21st, 2014. Understanding of Vyavasit, session number 28 or 29. Suzanne is with you the translating. Jai Sachidanan, please accept our highest namaskars from Suzanne and Shuddha. Suzanne? I, hey, hey, I can't hear Suzanne. Okay. Uh, Uwe, I can't hear Susanne. Susanne? Du bist unmuted, aber irgendwie hast du dich selber nochmal unmuted oder sowas? Now she is muted. Let's see. Susanne, what is it? And it's unmuted. Susanne, I can't hear you. We all cannot hear you. Now she's muted. Du machst nichts. Ich mach dich frei. Du musst gar nichts machen normalerweise. Okay. Das ist lustig. Okay. Susanne? Hey, Susanne. Alle, alle können sprechen, nur Susanne nicht. Okay, Susanne, can you know? Then let's see. Uh, everybody's muted. Over you speak. I, I can I can hear but I cannot hear Susanne. Me neither. Um Susanne, wenn du dich nochmal ausloggst und nochmal einloggst in um, in Ustream, uh, in um, ich weiß nicht was mit deinem Headset ist, wenn du nochmal rausgehst aus aus FaceTime, aus dem Zoom und nochmal reinkommst. I don't know. I I can unmute you, you speak I speak everybody else to speak, not only she does. I ask her to do it to get out and come back. Oh, can, can, can others hear you and me speaking? Can they, can they should and Uwe sprechen hören? Yes, they can. Okay, good. So, so we have... I worked before with her. I don't know what happened. Uh, well, let's... But we'll wait back until she is back. Okay. All right. Okay. In the meantime, where were we? We were going... Did, we had fi not finished our Vyavasit does not show anyone's faults. Had we finished that? We had not finished uh, it. Rich had sent an email, but I don't have the information right yeah, now. Yeah, but can someone write where we are? You know? So now let's see. Susanne, is it? Susanne is not online. Irgendwas is with your Kabel, Stecker, Mikrofon. Guck mal, irgendwie, du bist unmuted und wir hören dich nicht. Mit deinem Headset 
irgendwas, Kabel, es ist nichts, wir sehen dich, aber wir hören dich nicht, noch nicht, aber das wird gleich kommen. Irgendeine Herausforderung müssen wir haben. So we need one challenge to overcome in the technical. As the techniques work, something needs to. Maybe we can just say. No, no, she's doing it. Um, the, uh, what shall we do? Um, so what, what we, Susanne, is that, is that, uh, There she is. She's trying to get come with me on Skype. Hey, Susanne, should that not go on? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you now. Now I can hear you. <laughs> yeah, you have a lot of echo. Oh, okay, no, that's fine. I have Susanne on Skype with me. Fine for me. Okay. okay. All right, so that's good. So how does it work? Does this work okay now for everyone? Well, now I have it double. <laughs> well, I hear you twice. Let me see how I... Let okay, so what you have to do is turn down the volume of your... Once. Uh, your computer. How will she do that, Uwe? Because now she is with me on Skype and she is hearing. Is she hearing how? Are you hearing me from Skype or are you hearing me from this uh, Zoom? Zane? Yeah, I, I hear you double and I don't know how to arrange it now. Uh, let's it's see. Funny. <laughs> um, I, let's let's do it. Let's do it this way. I go back to, to Zoom. Ustream. Yeah. I just go to Ustream. I leave Zoom. Yeah, go and out I see you on Ustream. Oh, Ustream. That's what you. No, she is, she goes back to Skype. Skype. That's what she. She gets what she wants. She doesn't want to be on on the video. She gets it. No. Okay. All right. So. <laughs> <laughs> she gets what she wants. <laughs> she finally gets what she wants. <laughs> Uh, perfect. Okay. okay, so Susanne is on phone now. No, you are with me on Skype. On Skype, on Skype now. Okay, great. And then periodically, Uwe will show you. Okay, so that's good. All right, so does let's. He, does he still see me, Uwe? Uwe, Uwe, Uwe might see you, but we can't see you. <laughs> and we, okay. we see a message from Jesse. Jesse should that not go on? Jay Sachidan and. Okay, uh, so highest namaskars to everyone. So good to see everyone here now, live faces after all these years where we couldn't see each other, huh? Uh, ja, allerhöchste namaskars. Wie wunderbar euch zu sehen, uh, Shoda. Uh, Finde es ganz wunderschön, euch zu sehen, nachdem er euch so lange nicht sehen konnte und ja, uns auch so lange einander nicht sehen konnte. So, we, so as we talk, we just energize each other through through our vision and also we try to absorb actually and be with Dada which is the most important thing here, you know. Uh, Und während wir sprechen, energetisieren wir uns gegenseitig durch die Sicht, aber um, während wir sprechen sind wir auch mit Dada und das ist das Wesentliche dabei. This, uh, you know, you have to, we have to be constantly reminded of this Uh, beautiful truth, which is that my the real beauty is who I am, and let me be naturally that. Und wir müssen ständig daran erinnert werden, dass wer wir wirklich sind und was unsere Wahrheit ist und in natürlicher Weise darin sein. And if I want to appear beautiful and wonderful to others, then that is the source. Everything else is perishable and changing. Hmm? Und wenn ich äh, anderen ähm, als schön und angenehm erscheinen möchte, dann ist das äh, das Wichtigste und alles andere ist vorübergehend und ähm, vergänglich. You go, you go with a million candle watt uh, light in this world, walking around, trying to find beautiful ones. You, the only ones you will find is Mahatmas of Nani Purush Dadashu. Yes. Wenn du umhergehst und äh, durch äh, also Millionen umhergehst und äh, versuchst zu finden, wo Schönheit ist, dann sind die einzigen, die du finden wirst, die Mahatmas von Gnani Purush Dadashri. And uh, it, this is the this is the this is the line where the form 
uh, the form form becomes formless the form becomes formless das ist der bereich oder ja der bereich wo die gestalt gestaltlos wird die form formlos wird uh, so as the shuddhatma bhagwan as the as the absolutely pure ones uh, we start seeing the beauty in that which has form in other words we reverse as we you know as the vision of the self we move into the form and then start seeing the beauty in every human being that comes in front of us you see so wir beginnen die schönheit in jedem zu sehen der vor uns erscheint uh, während wir als shuddhatma bhagwan als reine uh, seelen umhergehen so it is a very beautiful play between the formless and the form the formless and the form the f o r m e d the formless and the form the formless and the form as a san sehr schönes spiel zwischen dem gestaltlosen und dem mitgestalt yeah the uh, the relative forms all seem to become truly relative the relative beauty becomes truly relative beauty uh, is and the real beauty of our own vision takes over um the relative, die, die relative gestalt wird wahrlich relativ und auch die relative schönheit wird wirklich zu einer relativen schönheit und the real beauty of our wish ah, und die wahre mm. die wahre schönheit unserer sicht übernimmt alles it is only with the exact application of the self and the vision of the self that beauty in life begins the exact application of the vision of the self should that ma bhagwan's vision should the vision should the drashti the pure vision it is only with the exact application Applic- of, of vision the of the self that yes, that real beauty begins ah nur mm-hmm. mit der exakten anwendung der sicht des selbst beginnt die wahre schönheit and all previous notions of that which is beautiful or more importantly that which is not so beautiful loses its hold on you it just totally has no it it loses its hold on you und die früheren sichtweisen von dem was schön ist und was nicht schön ist das verliert seine bedeutung the uh, it says if it says if Uh, the form the one f o r m e d the form the one the nada the christiana the rainer in front of me has somehow melted so to allow me to really allow my beautiful vision to proceed further in other words for you for christiana it is christiana melting for rainer it is rainer melting and then the beauty of your vision can really move forward otherwise it cannot und ähm es ist so als ja als ob der der gestaltete der mitgestalt also nada christian oder reiner irgendwie geschmolzen ist um dann zu erlauben dass die wahre schönheit und die sicht von schönheit und die das das ja die sicht die die schöne sicht wirklich nach vorne ähm sich entwickeln und sich zeigen kann so with the vidhi at the feet of our gnani purush as we see the beautiful image of at the feet of our gnani in always picture there with the vidhi at the feet of the gnani we begin uh, our satsang today und wir beginnen mit dem gebet zu den füßen des gnani ähm uh, unseren satsang heute dieses schöne bild der füße des gnani das uns uwe zeigt ja die die gnani purush when he was physically in front of everyone he would say come do the vidhi come on just if you cannot do anything else and if you do not even sit in my satsang if you don't listen to anything just do not leave without doing the vidhi 
without doing the VD. In other words, putting your forehead on his big toe, you see, on his toe, on his feet. I'm, I'm sorry, I didn't Our really get it. When Dada was living, when Dada Shri was physically living, if anybody would come in front of him, whether he was a Mahatma or not a Mahatma, he would always say, don't leave without doing the VD. Doing VD, Charan VD, Charan, Charan VD. Don't leave without doing the Charan VD. The Charan means the feet, the VD at the feet, you see. Um, als Dada noch gelebt hat, da war es so, wenn irgendjemand zu ihm kam, ob Mahatma oder nicht Mahatma, um, würde, hat er gesagt, uh, geht nicht weg, ohne das Charan Vidi zu machen, das Gebet zu den Füßen uh, des Gnani. I, in the chat, I have to say, Shuda, that in the chat they, they complain that uh, somehow the sound arrives uh, distorted. The sound is That's there. Ustream, in Ustream, I guess, yeah. Oh, in the Ustream it's coming distorted. Mm -hmm. So, okay, so there, well, is, so there uh, are some people also watching Ustream too, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I thought they were all on this uh, Zoom meeting. Oh, oh can they, um, hmm. I mean, we can, we can do, it has to do with the Skype connection, because now she's not in the, okay. in the same... Okay, so thing. shall we do this? Uh, for Jesse, we, so we, uh, Jesse has written something and that's what Susanne is saying. Susanne, I, yes. I can hear you very well, my dear. And I was also able to hear you very well before Uwe and I and everyone started, we, we started doing the satsang. So um, uh, shall we try you for you to come in? Uh, what you do is we will wait, you know, we'll wait while you just totally redo your, recycle your screen, close your Zoom and then open your Zoom only and nothing else. And okay, and but then I cannot see the chat, so some, we oh, have to chat? take care yeah, of the oh, chat somehow yeah. differently. You don't have to worry about the chat because Uwe, or, Uwe can monitor the chat or, uh, okay. or Nara can monitor the chat. Somebody else can monitor the chat. Use, Otherwise, you know. we can also use her, her phone. That's also a possibility. Yeah, like for instance, when when the question part comes in, Susanne, if somebody has questions, then Uwe can bring in the questions to me, in other words, on okay. Zoom. Okay, I can try again with the Zoom. Let's see what it might take, because I probably have to update, and then, yeah, let's see how it goes. Okay, okay. so we will, uh, what we will do is we will just kind of talk in general. We will okay. not go back, to, we'll talk in general, so while you come back. Huh? Or, so, so... Frage an die, an die Gruppe, die jetzt hört. Der Ton jetzt, wenn wir sprechen, Schuda und Uwe. So let's talk, Schuda. Okay, talk. and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to disconnect uh, okay. Susanne. Yes, there she goes. Okay, so... so now I want you just speak, give me some words and I will translate you. I just wonder if the tone is the, 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 the tone. Okay, so... Uh, so is good now. Okay, so now you, it's you and I, so... We were talking about the Vidi, the Charan Vidi, when Dada was physically present in this world, our Gnani Pur. Also, it's since Uwe and I, and uh, we have spoken about Dada, about Charan Vidi, about the Gebet to his feet, as he was, as he was alive. So, now they say it's very good. Oh, I see. So, that was maybe that was going through the Skype was the problem. <laughs> Jai Sachi, Jai Sachi, Dai Sachi. Otherwise, if she cannot be on Zoom, she can go on phone, yes, because then she's in Zoom too. Okay. Because the Skype, the Skype is always making these broken things. All right, yes. Yeah, because it tries to occupy too much, too much space then. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, uh, so, really, the concept of the Charan Vidi, Charan means feet. And uh, vidi means vidi, that which is worth doing at the feet of the gnani purush, you see. So, so this, this uh, chara is in Grunde genommen bedeutet uh, this, this vidi. I just need to look if she's coming. Hey, Rüdiger and Svenja, Jay Satchidana. Jay Satchidana, should that not be gone? Jay Satchidana. There is Susanne too. Good, beautiful. Okay, so. Susanne? Hast du deinen Zoom irgendwie unmuted? Guck mal, geh mal auf Voice bei dir, auf Audio. Guck mal, ob du dein, dein, äh, dein Audio falsch eingestellt hast. Wenn du auf Audio gehst, kannst du 
hier die Konferenz mit deinem Computer machen. Okay, so we have Svenja also, but we try. Is Svenja yes. sound coming through? No. Du hast nur ein, das ist nur ein Knopf irgendwo verschoben, sonst nichts. Wenn du auf Audio gehst und ein Audio versuchst zu machen, Audio Setting. Wenn du Settings klickst, und du gehst auf Audio, kannst du dort deinen Speaker machen. Wenn du Bildschirm schaust jetzt, siehst du es auch nochmal auf Settings. Da kannst du deine, deine Internal Speakers machen. Da kannst du einstellen, welche Speaker du nutzt. Und möglicherweise ist da ein falscher Haken an einem Speaker. Wenn du auf den Bildschirm schaust, siehst du es jetzt bei Ustream. Oh, den hast du, glaube ich, aus jetzt ausgesehen. Ja, jetzt. Ah. Jetzt. Hey. Nur leise. Aber jetzt hören wir die. Okay. Yeah, there is this. There you are. We can, we can hear you now. Hello, Shudat Mabugan. Okay, now how yes. about how about now? Yes. Mach mal dein Audio noch lauter. Du kannst es auf laut stellen. Output Volume hier. Hier bei dem Speaker kannst du es auf, wenn du auf Settings gehst, Audio, kannst du dein Volume relativ hoch stellen. Ja, okay, jetzt ist es hoch. Wie ist es jetzt? Ah, uh, uh, yeah, it's getting better. Manchmal noch dein, dein, äh, links, dein Mundstück besser an deinem Mund. Also mehr geht einfach nicht, ja. Ah. Jetzt das ist, ist gut. jetzt schon das Beste, was ich kann. Good, 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 good. Okay, all right, you that move on. So, so we were talking, uh, Susanne, we were talking about the Charan Vidi. Uh, and and the ch and we were saying that when only the, only after Gnani Purush Dada she left this body that the book uh, made uh, made came as the Charan Vidhi whereas when he was there you didn't need the book of the Charan Vidhi. Okay, erst nachdem der Gnani Purush seinen Körper verlassen hat, wurde dieses Buch Charan Vidhi gemacht. Solange er lebte, war das Buch nicht nötig. It's still a little louder, it'd be nice. Okay, that's good. I feel I'm already very loud. Now it's very good. Now it's very good. Okay, yes. Uh, and and he would, he would, this was very interesting. If you observe the, his satsang, he would even say to the person who is not a Mahatma, uh, come, come, do the vidi. Come, do the vidi. Selbst, und wenn er Satsa gemacht hat, selbst zu einer Person, die äh, das Gnavidi nicht genommen hat, fängt er zu sagen, komm her, äh, mach das Vidi, komm. And there must be a very deep reason in it. Uh, those many, many all those people who subsequently never took Gnan from Dada, but uh, took Gnan from maybe Niruma or Deepak Bhai, they said that it all comes back to them over and over again that they remember that part where they did the vidi with the gnani purush they touched his feet und da muss ein tiefer grund darin sein weil es gibt viele menschen die niemals gnan genommen haben von von gnani purush dada shri aber ein vidi zu seinen füßen gemacht haben und dann später gnan von niruma oder von dipak beigenommen haben Sie alle erinnern sich daran, wie sie das Vidi zu den Füßen des Gnani Purush gemacht haben. The, uh, he gives a tremendous, he always, this Gnani Purush, this Gnani of all the Gnanis give the maximum importance to the Vidi uh, with the Gnani, the Vidi before even doing anything. You see, so the feet of the Gnani is a reminder that if you don't know what to do, start with that visual image of, oh my absolute Lord within me, here I begin, here I go now, I move forward with this vision. Um, und das, der, der Gnani gibt dem die allerhöchste Bedeutung, bevor man irgendetwas anderes macht, dieses Gebet in den Füßen des Gnani zu machen. Und 
das ist äh, das, das Bild der Füße des Gnani, sind so eine Art Erinnerung daran. Und ähm, damit kannst du beginnen, wenn du, bevor du irgendwas anderes tust oder wenn du nicht weißt, was du tun sollst, kannst du damit beginnen mit dem Bild äh, seiner Füße und der inneren Sprache, oh mein Lord, ähm, ich verneige mich hier zu deinen Füßen. Ja, yeah, it's somehow... It's somehow the best preparation for proceeding further, even as we go into the understanding of this today's satsang about uh, about the, the science of vyavasthit, the science of the doer. Are, and we shall begin with today's reading then, shall we, Susanne? Okay, das war die beste Vorbereitung für das Verstehen der, des heutigen Satsangs, der Okay, so he's, uh, it says, was it somewhere there, Dadashri says, yes, therefore it is necessary to maintain patience, right? We are still in that paragraph. I thought we start, uh, we finish, uh, we, we continue at 24, Vyavastit does not show anyone's fault. That's what Grit um, wrote to me. Uh, we have still, okay, all 24, right. 24, yeah. the heading. Okay. Doesn't show anyone's fault. Okay, we doesn't show. So we begin there. We have will not show anyone's fault. Dada Shri. Mm -hmm. Dada Shri. All the doing is of Vyavasthit. Uh, and that is how we have seen it all. We have seen that. That is why we give you the guarantee. And Vyavasthit is the only thing that will not show anyone's fault. This is Vyavasthit. Have I not said that? It, it has no self-interest. It that vision it sees through vitaragata it sees through vitaragata dada schrieb sagt alles handeln liegt bei vyavasthit wir haben das gesehen deswegen geben wir dir die garantie vyavasthit ist das einzige das von niemandem die fehler aufzeigt das ist vyavasthit habe ich das nicht gesagt es hat kein Selbstinteresse. Es sieht durch Vitaragata, durch den konstanten Zustand absoluter Freiheit und Anhaftung an. Uh, if one understands Vyavasthit, it will help a lot. Um, otherwise, if he asks you to get back in the car, coming back to the car incidents, you will have such disgust on on your face. You it will show on your face. Hey, you. Then the other is saying, Hey, you. Why did you get disgusted in such a short time? How did you get disgusted in such a short time? Uh, so why and how did your facial expression change? Wenn man Vyavasthit versteht, wird es eine Menge helfen. Ansonsten wird sich derartige Entrüstung auf deinem Gesicht zeigen, wenn er dich bittet, wieder ins Auto zu steigen. Hey du, warum zeigst du nach so kurzer Zeit Entrüstung? Wie hast du dich in so kurzer Zeit empört? Um. Questioner. Dada. I can remain calm for maybe two or three times, Dada. <laughs> but by the fourth time, everything that is collected from within will explode or get poured out, Dada. Dada Shri says, yes, therefore it is necessary to maintain patience, to maintain patience. Dada, Dada, ich kann zwei bis drei Mal ruhig bleiben. Aber beim vierten Mal wird alles ausgegossen, was sich innerlich angesammelt hat. Dada schrie, ja, deshalb ist es wichtig, Geduld und 
Ausdauer zu bewahren. Dada, questioner is asking, besides this uh, Jivan Murti, uh, a living uh, Gnani, who can explain this so clearly, Dada? And uh, Dada Shri replies, yes, you will not find this in a book, will you? It will not be there in a book. If it was in a book, then everybody would become a Vitarag, absolutely free from any attachment or abhorrence, would he not? If everyone understood Vyavasthit, everyone will become Vitarag. That's a flat statement. It is not in any scriptures. This path of ours is not, be found, not to be found in scriptures. The path I am telling you, it will not be found in any scripture. In scriptures, all you are shown are the tools, the means, the ways, the sadhans, which tell you what to do and what not to do. Definition of a sadhan. Definition of a sadhan is just given right there. Here, there is no path of doership. It is a path of understanding. We have gone higher via doership. We have gone higher via doership. We have even risen higher above illusion or branti. So the whole discussion is totally different, is it not? This talk will be helpful for you all in Germany, will it not? Vater, Dada, wer kann die so deutlich erklären, außer einem lebenden Gnani, einem Sajiva Murti? Dada schrieb, ja, du wirst dies nicht in einem Buch finden, oder? Es wird in keinem Buch stehen. Wenn es in einem Buch stehen dann würde jeder zum Literat werden, die jemanden ohne jegliche Anhaftung darstellen. Wenn sie ja was Tit verstünden, würde jeder Literat werden. Es steht in keiner Schrift. Dieser Weg wird in Schritten nicht gefunden. Der Weg, über den ich zu dir spreche, wird in keinen Schriften gefunden werden. Alles, was dir in den Schriften gezeigt wird, sind die Werkzeuge, die dir sagen, was du tust und was nicht. Die heißen Sadans. Hier gibt es keinen Weg des Handelns. Es ist ein Weg des Verstehens. Wir sind über das Handeln der Sein hinausgegangen über die Täuschung Branti hinausgegangen. Somit ist das gesamte Gespräch anders, oder nicht? Dieses Gespräch wird hilfreich sein, nicht wahr? Mm -hmm. And say you're sitting in a garden and someone says to you, leave. Now it's necessary, you can make the request to him and say, my friend, I would love, I'd like to sit a little longer. You don't mind, do you? And if he says, no, leave, then understand that it is vyavasthit. If he says, no problem, then that too is vyavasthit. If you are removed from the car, it is vyavasthit, and it is also vyavasthit if you are not removed from the car. In short, if you understand just this much, then you will find a way out. Uh, find a way out of this uh, worldly complexities of life after life wandering way out. Otherwise it cannot be understood even after a million lifetimes. Dada says we, the Gnani Purush and the Absolute One within him, we have seen through our Gnan that this is run by Vyavasthit. This is run by Vyavasthit. Dada Shri sagt weiter, sagen wir, du sitzt in einem Garten und jemand sagt zu dir, geh weg. Wenn nötig, äußere ihm gegenüber den Wunsch. Ich würde gern ein bisschen länger sitzen bleiben, wenn es dir nicht ausmacht. Wenn er sagt, nein, geh, dann verstehe, dass es Vyavasthit ist. Und wenn er sagt, kein Problem, ist das auch es sind die sich bedingenden Umstände, wenn du aus dem Auto geworfen wirst. Und es ist ebenso wie Avastit, wenn du im Auto bleiben kannst. Kurz gefasst, wenn du so viel verstehst, 
dann wirst du einen Ausweg finden. Schule hat ergänzt, einen Ausweg aus diesem weltlich Leben, aus diesem Leben, aber Leben, aber Leben. Ansonsten kann es auch in einer Million Jahren nicht verstanden werden. Wir, der Knallin Busch, haben das durch unser Gnaden gesehen, dass dies von mir was tiefst gesteuert wird. One becomes a god if he completely understands vyavasthit. Emphasis on the word completely. In fact, man wird Gott, wenn man vyavasthit vollständig nicht begreift, und es geht hier um das Wort vollständig. A slight correction in the translation. From Gujarati, I am looking at Gujarati. Dada Shri says, one becomes a complete God, not just, Dada Shri has used the word complete before a God. One becomes a complete God if he becomes, if he completely understands Vyavasit. However much one understands, by that much he becomes a god. <laughs> also nochmal eine, eine Korrektur. Der Satz heißt, man wird vollständig zu Gott, wenn man die Avastit vollständig begreift. So viel wie man versteht, in diesem Verhältnis wird man zu One will not have to curse others in his mind if he understands we have a sit. In other words, one will not uh, curse others inside if he understands we have a sit. You bind karma in, you bind karma when in your mind you say he's bad, she's bad. He is not bad. But it is Vyavasthit that is telling him to get, telling him to tell you, remove this person from the car, remove him from the car. Vyavasthit directs everyone and that is how the tops are all spinning in this world of ours. Vyavasthit is directing everyone. Wenn man Vyavastit versteht, muss man andere nicht in seinen Gedanken verfluchen. Du bindest Karma, wenn du in deinen Gedanken sagst, er ist böse. Er ist nicht böse, aber es sind die sich bedingenden Umstände, Vyavastit, die ihn denken. Die sagen, dass man wirf ihn aus dem Auto. Vyavastit denkt jeden und so drehen sich diese Kreise. Beautiful answer here. A yeah, beautiful new definition of God coming in front of us. Very subtle definition of God here in front of us. Just in the paragraph before, we just in this two lines before the last paragraph. And a very beautiful new definition of God. A very subtle definition. And 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 it has everything because you see the Gnani says every human being is a god uh, is a god whether he has received the Gnanvidi or not received the Gnanvidi every human being has is is a god now the Mahatma after receiving the Gnanvidi has begun to become a god. He has begun to become a god because he has just received the first understanding of Vyavasthit. Der Gnani Purush sagt, dass jedes menschliche Wesen ein Gott ist, ob er nun dann wieder erhalten hat oder nicht. Für die Mahatmas ist es so, dass sie nach dem Gnanini begonnen haben, zu Gott zu werden. Und warum? Weil sie ein erstes Verstehen von Vyavastit bekommen haben. 
and and the the uh, the understanding the simplest definition the final ultimate definition is right there in front of us it's it's the practical definition of god now for those who are now on the path of becoming a god like you and i uh, and the practical definition of becoming a god is exactly dependent upon the understanding and the prevailing understanding of vyavasthit Yeah, I, I, see every. The the you know if for it's we are not concerned by anybody else's definition of what a god is having become, having entered the path of liberation. Our definition changes now. See, and the definition really is uh, to what extent. am i understanding vyavasthit you see what and that is the new definition of of being a god the new definition of being a god is right there in front of us that we just read you think we we start to us not with irgendwelche anderen definitionen darüber was ein gott ist uh here direct vor unseren augen ist die definition Yeah. Yes. You see, the, the the conventional definition used to be the extent with which you understand the Atma, the soul. Uh, you are a god. No. That is saying it the other way around. You are the soul. You cannot ex. You cannot understand who you are. You can only understand that which is in front of you, and that which is in front of you is vyavasthit. So the more and more you understand vyavasthit, the more you become who you really are, which is you are a god. since that that which we have become will only become full in will only become full paramatma we have become shuddhatmas pure souls we become absolute souls as we as we understand and this understanding is is uh, the test of those understandings came in the last satsang but as this understanding takes hold of of scientific circumstantial evidences uh, in its totality and that is the that is the godhood the godhood or our state of being a god you see here yeah. that is our state of being a god Umstände immer mehr Raum ergreift, immer 
größer wird, in, in seiner Totalität äh, sich ausbreitet. Das, nee. ist die, das ist die Göttlichkeit, das ist unser Zustand von Gott sein. Ja, yeah, beautiful, because you see, this sentence is very beautiful, beautifully connected with the second sentence in the first paragraph of today's satsang, which is, Vyavasthit is the only thing in this universe that does not let you see mistakes or faults of anyone. See, we, you read that, Susanne, our Susanne just read that, remember? That in the first, first, uh, the sec, in the first paragraph, Vyavasthit is the only thing that in this universe that does not show anyone's faults. Dieser Satz ist auf eine wunderschöne Weise verbunden mit dem Satz ganz am Anfang, den wir gelesen haben. Ja, was tut, lässt sich nicht die Fehler von irgendjemandem sehen. And, and you see, beautiful two definitions are given only directly in the first paragraph, of, which lets you explain the flawless vision. The flawless vision is the vision that is associated with a, an increasing understanding of scientific circumstantial evidences. It is, that is the only vision which will not let you see flaws anywhere. Everything else is flawed vision or faulty vision. Faulty vision. And then, it, you know, just if you read again the first paragraph, you see some very beautiful things in there. Uh, Dada Shri says that if you, that is the only vision which is selfless, small s c l f. Selfless means which is without any selfishness. Everything, every other vision in this universe is associated with some selfish intent or the other, something where something or somewhere there is some some personal something selfish, you see. Und wenn man den ersten Absatz wieder liest, dann ist das die Sicht, das ist die einzige Sicht, in der kein Selbstinteresse darin ist, also eine Sicht, wo keinerlei Eigeninteresse ist, alles andere hat irgendetwas Persönliches, irgendetwas an Eigeninteresse in and, sich. And you see, this selfishness uh, is again defined in the, uh, in the reverse way by saying that when there is no selfishness, how do you, how do you know there is no selfishness? Then the answer is, the vision is associated with Vitaragata, there is Uh, it is not something that you say, I'm not going to go this way or this way. With Rakta, as we discussed the last time, it is above Samabhav, it is above Samata, it is perfect equanimity. There is nothing in the world that can shake you. I'm sorry, that was long. Mm -hmm. selbstsüchtig ist, ohne Eigeninteresse, wenn es äh, Vitaragata ist, also ohne Anhaftung und Abscheu, oberhalb von Samatha, in perfekten, in perfekten Gleichen. And even when you look at this, in, in other words, I don't, you know, you say, I don't want to be selfish. There is only, the only way in which you cannot, you cannot, can be not selfish in this universe, in this world of ours, is when you have the Rhine Sile, when you have become the Rhine Sile, uh, then only really you are moved away from any kind of selfishness. Until then, even the one who says, I have no interest, I don't, I don't want anything, I don't want anything, 
it is that is not called selfishness absolute selfishness is vitaragata is that neither rag nor dvesh you are not moved from where you are at all in either direction you are simply right there hmm selbst wenn man selbstlos sein möchte man sagt ich möchte ganz also ohne irgendwelche selbstsucht sein dann musst du das das ist nur möglich wenn du wirklich zur reinen seele geworden bist und das ist der einzige die einzige möglichkeit wo man völlig wegbewegt ist von irgendwelcher Selbstsucht und irgendwelchem Selbstinteresse. Und derjenige, der sagt, ich möchte keine Selbstsucht haben, der ist trotzdem, hat trotzdem Selbstsucht und Eigeninteresse. Der Nur mit der Ragata hat keinerlei Anhaftung oder Anschauung. Ja, yeah. you know, our Gnani, our Gnani, uh, our dear, dear Gnani Purushtada Shri, he gives you a glimpse of his spiritual quest not only in this life but for life after life when in his in the second paragraph when he's he's asking hey you in fact he uses the word muwa all of you are familiar with the word muwa right m o o a h muwa <laughs> another you dying one hey you dying one you're going to die in, you know you're only going in one direction and hey you move uh how in the heck how in the world did your face change an expression in no time how you know what happened but susanna is familiar with the word move i'm sure she'll tell you more about it der Gnade gibt uns hier einen, einen kleinen Einblick in seine eigene spirituelle Suche über viele Leben. Und das Wort, was hier in dem zweiten Absatz tatsächlich benutzt wird im Originaltext, ist Ebua, Ebu, der, der Sterbende, der nur in sich nur in eine Richtung bewegt, nämlich in Richtung Tod. Das ist hier im Englischen nicht übersetzt, sondern nicht im Deutschen. Aber Hey du, dieser Moa, dieser Sterbende, wie ist es möglich, dass du empört bist? Was ist da passiert? Yeah, for us all, we just use the word, oh you dying one, oh you dying one, the oh you one who is dying every second. What's going on? You, you are acting as if you're going to live forever. Yes. So, he, uh, uh, he, he gives you his vision is his vision is in no time how come the facial expression changed and he is not blaming the person he is trying to make us see the reactions that are going on inside a human going being it his he he internalizes our vision even in the ways he is uh, he's conducting the satsang with us you see Yeah, you know when we read this, when here, when we, when you read the second paragraph, by the way, and let me go there because I want to go there uh, because of what you read. Um, uh, he says, um, "Hey, you, Mua, why did you get disgusted in such a short time? How did you get disgusted in such a short time? What happened to you?" Now. he is internalizing our vision for because now he is doing the satsang with mahatmas and you know he is saying what happened to you inside you know he is not he is not trying to say uh, what what happened dada he threw me out and that is why i i am upset that's not the answer he is looking for he is try, by he is asking the question in such a way so he is saying what have, what happened to you that your face changed you know you see see the tone of the satsang the, the way the gnani is telling you taking you deeper rather than focusing on dada he threw me out of the car and that is why i'm upset his dada is wanting you to internalize this understanding to go inside and find out why the face changed also mit diesem mit diesem 
Satz, hey, äh, Noah, hey du, Sterbender, äh, warum zeigst du nach so kurzer Zeit Entrüstung? Wie hast du dich in so kurzer Zeit empört? Da ähm, versucht er uns selbst, also uns zu helfen, dass wir diese Reaktion sehen, diese schnelle Veränderung, diese schnelle Veränderung im Gesichtsausdruck. Aber wenn wir das lesen, führt er unsere Sicht auch nach innen, denn hier macht er einen Satz auf dem Mahatmas. Und ähm, also er, er leitet unsere Sicht nach innen und ähm, erwartet hier nicht die Antwort, ja, mal, ich bin so sauer, weil der mich rausgeworfen hat, sondern er fragt, was ist in dir innerlich passiert, dass deine, dein Gesicht sich so verändert? And, and, and the satsang leads up to this very beautiful word which has got a, a lot of importance in spiritual and liberation uh, literature that liberates in India that especially not ordinary literature but that literature which liberates and that word is Sajivan Murti you see the uh, uh, a living uh, Gnani uh, uh, and it comes right back to comes right back to this uh, beautiful image of uh, our dada's feet that uh, that uve showed us all in the beginning of the satsang see uh, yeah, but it's saying that it's essentially saying where where else will i be able to understand my understand this faulty vision of mine you see, who can explain all of these beautiful things? Who else can explain except you, my Odada, you see? Und ähm, der Satzang führt uns zu den Worten, die, ähm, die auch mit der Literatur zu tun haben, die befreit, der indischen Literatur die befreit. Und hier ist das Wort ähm, Sajiva Murti der lebende Gnani und sofort kommt dieses wunderschöne Bild von Dada Shri äh, vor unsere Augen, das Bild, was uns nur am Anfang gezeigt hat, das äh, Foto von seinen Füßen. Und wo sonst äh, werde ich meine fehlerhafte Sicht verstehen? Wer, wer sonst kann mir das äh, so erklären, außer dem lebenden Gnani, Sanjiva Murti? Ja. And you see the essence of the Akram Vignani, the new, uh, the new science that we have, and the essential reason for our Gnani Purushtada Shri is really to make us all understand the nature of the doer. If and and whether we are uh, whether we are Mahatmas or non Mahatmas. The essence of his satsang was always heavily focused on did you do it or did it happen? Did you do it or did it happen? Um, und die, die Essenz unseres uh, Akram Vignani, die Essenz, die ganze, der ganze essentielle Grund, warum unser Gnani gesprochen hat, war, um uns verstehen zu lassen, uh, die, die Natur des Handels um einen Mahatma ging oder auch um einen Nicht-Mahatma. Die entscheidende Frage war, hast du es getan oder ist es passiert? Hast du es getan? And, and, and when he says that, you know, as down below as we go, and he says that uh, this path, this here, this group of ours, this path, this satsang of ours is, is beyond above all doership and also above all illusions uh, so two levels of understanding not only not only the level, level above doership but also a level above the illusion above the illusion uh, because you and i both know that even though we understand that we are not the doers we get covered by the clouds of the illusion, you see. Covered, we, it's like yeah, a fog. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, 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 I just uh, have to write sure. it down, else I will forget. Sure, my dear. Mm -hmm. no, no, I was just... <laughs> my, uh, my head is so <laughs> cloudy. Mm -hmm. um, 
wir, äh, es geht darum, dass wir nicht nur jenseits von Handelnder sein sind, oh, sondern ja, ja. auch jenseits von Illusionen. Ja, yeah, okay. All right, so should that okay. not What happened? Yeah. I didn't, I didn't fully I, I, translate yeah. the last. Yeah, I let you, I let you do that. I let you finish okay. it. Danke. Also, um, es sind das, das sind zwei Ebenen, nicht nur die Ebene jenseits von Handelnder sein, sondern auch die Ebene jenseits oder oberhalb von Illusionen, von Täuschung. Denn selbst wenn wir verstehen, um, dass wir nicht der Handelnde sind, wird doch werden wir doch immer wieder umhüllt oder bedeckt von einer Wolke von Täuschung oder einer Wolke von Illusion. Ja, und Uwe hat das äh, T-Zeichen gemacht im Sinne von Pause, Break. <laughs> okay, so we take a break. Should that move on? So we leave you all we'll be back, huh? Jay Sachidan. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay.
Okay, should that number go in? Yes. Jai Sachidana. Oh. Jai Sachidana. Everybody get a little break here. <laughs> we have so many here. Well, Reiner is actually. Now your sound is much better now when you said that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah, this is now all right. Yes. Maybe when you look down or something, it maybe goes somewhere else. <laughs> well, um, I have to write down, I have to look at the text, so... Yeah, no, but when you, it has something to do with where it is being picked up in your computer. This is so highly focused a, uh, a program that it picks your voice if you speak to the computer. <laughs> so, dein Mikro is it better, oder? Keine Ahnung. Okay. Wir nehmen es einfach. Wir sind bereit, Shuda. Are you ready? I'm ready. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are, we are, we are ready. Okay, just before we begin with the second half, uh, welcome everyone. Helmut, Jay, Sachidana, Shuddha, Mabagwan. Jay and Klaus, yeah. yes. Jay, Sachidana, Jesse, hey, hey, hey. Christina, Zalminder, Bettina, Marion, uh, Andrea, should, yes. Yes, so wonderful. You know, it's like being with family, huh? Mahatma family. Mahatma family. Yeah, Doris, there she is. Uh -huh. Well, just before we begin the second half here, we just wanted to kind of give you one more definition of this uh, Sajivan Murti or the living Gnani. The living Gnani. There is no escape. There is there is no liberation without understanding the exact meaning of this word Sajivan Murti or the living Gnani. Just as Vyavasit is important, this also has a very deep meaning. The living Gnani. And while it begins with <coughs> the appreciation of a living Gnani uh, in front of you, uh, the definition progressively shifts inside within you until it becomes you only. Um, it begins with the Verehrung des lebenden Gnani vor dir und dann um, bewegt sich diese Definition allmählich in dich hinein, bis du dazu wirst. In other words, in all matters of life, a time will come when really the answers will come from the awakened one within you only and nowhere else. Und in allen Angelegenheiten des Lebens wird es wird eine Zeit kommen, wo die Antworten einzig von dir, von diesem Inneren, aus deinem Inneren kommen. And that is really the path of the Vitarag. You see, we say what we all talk about the path of the Vitarag. The Raga. The path of the Vitarag begins with an external gnani and then it ends uh, with the state of the gnani inside this. We are not talking about gnanvidi and doing it for others. We are talking about our own personal uh, rise to that state. Das ist der Weg des Literat, der beginnt mit dem äußeren Gnani und dann äh, geht das immer mehr nach innen. Und wir sprechen nicht über das Gnani, sondern wir sprechen über diesen persönlichen Aufstieg zu diesem Zustand. And the exact, and the exact and the most precise way of 
entering into that is through these five agnas of our Gnani Purush, the third one of which we are getting deeper and deeper into these satsangs, isn't it? And, and you know, in the following paragraph after that, you know, you're sitting in the garden and the guy says, leave now. And the other, or, and, he's, and the other she says, if he tells you to leave, that is also vyavasthit, and if he tells you to stay, that is also vyavasthit. Uh, has got so many interesting practical applications for you and I, all of us. Uh, because... This next absatz where he talks about the garden, when someone tells you to go back, is that vyavasthit, and when he tells you to go back, then leave your life, is that also vyavasthit. And... In, in that one, Dada Shri is giving us a little bit of an option. You see, it is Dada Shri's, you know, before and before that paragraph, Dada is talking about the highest state, the highest state of Vyavasthit, Vitarakta, no selfishness, all of that flawless vision. But in that particular paragraph about the garden, he is he's being he's being nice to us. He's coming down a little bit, and he is giving us another option. See, he's giving us a little bit of a more practical understanding. It's it's uh, he's making uh, he's making allowances for what file one wants. In other words, the file one feels like sitting a little bit longer in the garden, and the man says, "Leave." Uh, you see, so you and I all have our desires in life, and the other Sri is making allowances for that in this understanding of Yavastad. <clears throat> You and I all have residual discharging desires. We would like to have things in life happen in a certain way. Uh, and this is an example. This is kind of an interesting example. In other words, the Adashtri says, if this arises, you can request. You, you can certainly make the request. There's nothing wrong with it. You can try in the relative and see what happens, you see. And then see what happens. Also, we all have a rest, a rest from sich entladenen Wünschen. Es gibt da Dinge, uh, ja, im Leben, von denen wir gern hätten, dass sie auf eine bestimmte Weise passieren. Wenn so etwas aufkommt, dann kannst du eine Bitte aussprechen. Du kannst, du kannst das probieren und dann sehen, was passiert. And you know, you know, my friends, this is where Mahatmas get stuck. They, in their desire to have it their way in life, I would like to have it this way. They, they somehow slip from this understanding which follows in this paragraph. In it is exactly there in the paragraph. The other she says, there's nothing wrong in for you to try and try your best. You like chocolates, go for it. Or, you know, you want to do certain things, you want to do it that way, you know, you can make your attempts, but uh, have the inner understanding 
that that it is all we have a state that it is all determined is is exact so um so there is this you see there is there is this allowance it's not as if you know you can't jump to the level where you say it is we have a state and you know move on you try your best yeah uh oder sagt ihr, liebe Freunde, wir, das ist nicht für uns alle so, das hat was da also stecken, feststecken oder verloren gehen im Leben, weil sie Dinge gerne auf die Weise hätten, die sie mögen. Und ähm, da gibt es dann nur einen, einen Wechsel im Verstehen. Und ja. da ist nicht, auch nichts falsch dran. Ähm, da hat er schon gesagt, sagt uns, ja, wenn da ein Wunsch ist, dann dann, geh, dann äh, streb danach, dann versuch es, mach, deinen, mach da einen Versuch, wenn du Schokolade magst oder was auch immer. Aber äh, hab dieses innere Verstehen, dass es wieder was tut ist und dass es sozusagen festgelegt ist. You, you see how, how the Gnani has, has kind of allowed us a, a little bit of a space uh, for the desires of a Mahatma in discharge here. Und, und jetzt seht ihr, wie uns Dada hier so ein bisschen Raum gegeben hat für die Wünsche eines Mahatma. Er hat uns jetzt die Erlaubnis gegeben, äh, da den Wünschen ein bisschen nachzugeben. Ja, yeah. the Shri has said, and let me see if it's been translated right, uh, if And you, you have the, yeah, you, it's been done right. In other words, you feel like you want to stay a little bit longer. You'd like to stay a little longer. So request him. And and then if he says stay, that is Vyavasit. If he says leave, that is Vyavasit. It's a very beautiful inner understanding for a Mahatma. It's a, it's a beautiful understanding because then all fights in life seem to come to an end because the final fight is associated with that which is deeply connected with what one really wants still wants to have it her way or my way or I want to do it my way um, ja, Dadashri hat ja hier gesagt wenn du etwas länger im Garten sein möchtest dann kannst du und du den Wunsch hast also ich würde gerne noch ein bisschen länger sitzen bleiben wenn es dir nicht ausmacht, wenn dann der andere sagt, ja, bleib, dann ist es wieder was tut. Und wenn der andere sagt, nein, geh, ist es auch wieder was tut. Und das ist ein sehr schönes Verstehen, denn auf diese Weise kommen alle Pfeils, alle Konten zu einem Ende. Und diese, dieses, diese letzten Konten, die sind so verbunden mit diesen Wünschen. Sla you know, when, when Dada Shri says, If you can just understand this much, just this much, you you will find solutions after solutions after solutions in any problem in life, uh, and you'll find a way out. And he says, otherwise you cannot even understand. You won't understand means you will not find a solution in a million lifetimes, in a million lifetimes. Da hat er schon gesagt, wenn du nur so viel verstehst, dann wirst du Lösung und Lösung und Lösung finden für viele Probleme. Andernfalls wirst du keine Lösung finden in Millionen von Lebenszeiten. So for us all, the solutions of a million lifetime is given in only one word. We for we have a sit. You see, just we for we have a sit. A million lifetimes are gone. We have zero, zero problems. We have no concerns about it anymore. Now, does everyone understand this? Everyone in this group understand this, uh, this, sec this paragraph about the garden? Everyone understands it? It may seem easy at, when you read it, 
but there is a lot of deeper uh, practical application in our daily life in it. So, so this is a classic uh, uh, answer, this is a classic paragraph, the perfect paragraph for a Mahatma who says, who comes and comes to you, say Uva or say Nada and says, well, do I do this or do I don't do this? Do I do this or do I don't do this? You see? And then the answer is, the answer is right there. We don't have to let Dada's, Dada's given the answer right now in front of us. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Uvaji, is there any questions here on the anybody or uh, shall we continue or what shall we do? In the moment, I don't see any questions in the chat. Okay, okay. Let me, let me ask them. Let me ask them. If, mm -hmm. So, im Moment sehen wir keine Fragen. Ist jemand da von euch, der Fragen hat? Hier jetzt im, auch im Chat, also in, im Zoom, er möge seine Hand heben, er hat jetzt die Chance. Und dann kann er direkt fragen, indem wir euch freischalten. Nada, Chief, okay. Nada, Nada has a question. Okay, should that not be gone? Should that not be gone? Vielleicht kann Shura das nochmal ausführen, was er gerade jetzt zum Schluss gesagt hat über... Wenn eben die Zünger immer wieder bei Mahatmas, die sagen, soll ich das tun, soll ich das tun, was soll ich denn jetzt tun? Wie würde jetzt Schuller diesen, diesen Abschnitt für diese Frage interpretieren? Also genau die Antwort aus diesem Text von Schuller über wie war es das? Weil wie war es das ist da jetzt kein Mensch, der jetzt da irgendwas sagt, sondern wie können Mahatmas das wirklich anwenden jetzt durch diesen Abschnitt? Um, Nada is asking you, should I do explain further what you just said about that um, paragraph. So if someone comes saying, should I do that or should I not do that, how would, should I answer that question in the sense of that paragraph? How would you say that? Yeah, you know, and there exactly is there in the paragraph, my dear. It just says, Dada says, in other words, this obviously is, is for a Mahatma. I mean, we're not talking of people who are not received the Gnanvidhi, the entire knowledge and the science of Vyavasthit is for Mahatmas, right? So, then the answers are exactly there in this paragraph of, of the garden example, the being in the garden. Uh, so... Wir sprechen hier nicht über eine Person, die kein Gnanvidhi genommen hat. Und die Antworten sind ganz präzise da. So, in, in essence, it is exactly this. You, because you see, say, say, Nara, you go to Switzerland or wherever you go and you are sharing Akram Vignan. The exact understanding is right there. And the exact understanding is the following. You should tell the Mahatma that if investigate whether it is necessary for you in other words there is the word you know the other Sri is saying if you it let me read it in English make sure you have the right translation uh, if necessary in other words the first thing is you know many more many times we kind of often say I want to do this I want to do this but there is not even the 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 inner questioning is it necessary so you see that word dada says if necessary <clears throat> it's there also um, shura is it noch mal genauer in den text reingegangen er sagt in der essenz ist es genau das was da steht wenn er jemand sagt soll ich mich weiß ich nicht dann ist uh, die 
erste Frage, die man stellen sollte, ist es notwendig? Das ist hier einfach nur so ein kleiner äh, so. zwei Worte. Wenn, wenn nötig, also ist es notwendig? Denn ganz oft äh, ist da nicht die innere Frage, ist das wirklich nötig? The, you know, many times, say somebody comes and asks you, Nada, Nada, do I do this or do I not do this? Now, whenever somebody asks this kind of a question, that person is already leaning one way or the other. Don't you believe that they are exactly in the middle and they can do this or they're not this? They are already leaning towards something that they would like to do. And they are asking Nada because they want Nada to be there to support in that decision. See? They want Nada's approval. Uh, so inside the person who is asking the question, there is always, even though they say, I don't know what to do. Do I do this or I don't do this? They have an inclination one way or the other when you really think about it. Also, when someone comes and uh, Nada fragt, soll ich das tun oder das tun, dann hat er immer schon eine Präferenz für eine Seite, für die eine oder eben die andere Seite. Da gibt es schon etwas, was er lieber tun würde als das andere und er möchte deine Zustimmung, deine Unterstützung dafür. Und so, so then, then, then the answer becomes like this. My, my dear, if you really think it's necessary, go ahead and do this. Uh, go ahead and do this, try your best, and then see what happens. Because that is the thing, see what happens. He, the other person may say, may, do, may agree with and help you, or he may not help you, and be prepared for both of those decisions with this inner answer that it is all via vastit. Hmm? Und dann, wenn also diese Frage da ist, dann ist die Antwort, also wenn du wirklich meinst, dass es notwendig ist, dann geh und versuch es, mach dein Bestes, gib dein Bestes und dann schau, was passiert. Und die andere Person, also dann da, da wo das passiert, die das mag passen, da magst du Hilfe bekommen oder auch nicht sei bereitet dafür, Yes. In other words, the Gnani really knows, the Gnani Purush really knows Vyavasthit in its totality. The Mahatmas who are asking the question have, has, have a little bit of a doubt in terms of, well, do I go for it or do I not go for it? Do I do it or do I don't do it? And so the Gnani then says, if you, if there is a need within you, then go ahead, go in, go for it, and then see what happens. See, wait for the result, and then do not fight the result. That is what the Gnani is saying. Do not have a fight with the result. The Gnani Purush kennt ja was tut in seiner Gesamtheit, in seiner Totalität. Aber die Mahatmas haben Zweifel und es also dieser Wunsch und da sagt er, ja, dann ja, geh, ähm, geh dafür, dann setz dich dafür ein, wenn da dieser... Achso, die Frage ist, soll ich es tun oder soll ich es nicht tun? Und die Antwort ist, ähm, wenn da eine Notwendigkeit ist, wenn es wirklich nötig ist, äh, dann, dann mach es und warte auf die Resultate. Kämpf nicht gegen das Ergebnis. So, die... It is an experiment of movement of the doer as well as the knower in a field towards the final knower only. The doer is allowed to do something, but the Gnani knows that he is really the knower. <laughs> I think I didn't get that, Shida. Sorry, let me say it again. <laughs> It, this is an experiment of the doer, the, the doer and the knower going together a little bit, you know, the doer and the, you know, is, the Gnani says, oh, you want to do something, huh? Okay, go ahead and do something. Also, it is a kind of experiment, a journey of thinking and of knowing, together, and it's about, at some point, 
zum, allein zum Wissen zu werden, aber wenn du denkst, du bist der Handelnde, na gut, dann probier ein bisschen aus und sei der Handelnde. Ja, because you see, the Gnani has to extricate the ultra, ultra heavy, the deep, deep, heavy, heavy doers from uh, into the into the land of liberation and the light doers into the land of liberation. <laughs> he has to make he has to make room for all the doers. <laughs> the Gnani must all these handelnden in das Land der Befreiung bringen, die ganz schwer, uh, schweren, großen handelnden und auch die ganz leichten, ein bisschen handelnden, die alle sollen ja in das Land der Befreiung. And, and you know the Gnani, to, in all fairness to the heavy doers, in all the fairness to the heavy doers, uh, it is all, all the intensity of the darkness, is it not? I mean, in other words, the darker, you know, like, for example, if you're walking out of the home and it is dark, uh, it, it is dark, you know, but as your eyes get adjusted to it, you can manage to walk even though it's dark. Uh, whereas if it is pitch dark, black, black dark, I mean, no matter what you do, you can't walk straight, you see. So these are the intensities of the lack of light in this chart that the Gnani is helping with. See? besonders stark handelnden äh, da Gerechtigkeit äh, zukommen zu lassen. Es hat zu tun mit der Intensität der Dunkelheit. Wenn du äh, hinausgehst und es da dunkel ist, äh, dann kannst du am Anfang nicht sehen, aber sobald deine Augen sich daran gewöhnt haben, äh, an die Dunkelheit, dann kannst du laufen. Und, äh, und, wenn du, und wenn es super richtig ganz dunkel ist, total dunkel, uh, then it's given even kind of the, uh, the, the most important uh, uh, word there really is if it, if you find that you need it, if it is necessary, if you want, the man says leave, but you know, you are, you have the awareness, relative awareness that you'd like to stay. So you would, there is this awareness of a need in you. And, uh, and therefore you want to stay. You know, the, that is essentially all doership on this earth is based on a need, is it not? <laughs> all doership is based on a need, that's what you said, right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, when, when, now we know, now we know that any, if anybody does anything, there is some, some, he's driven by some need, right? <laughs> some... Uh, also, das, das wichtigste Wort in all dem ist dieses is es nötig? Ist das, denkst du, findest du das notwendig? Da ist dieses Gewahrsein von einer Notwendigkeit. Und Tuda sagt, alles äh, handelnde Sein basiert auf einem. Auf einem mm -hmm. and, and yes, in other words, this, this, this is the subtle point in you know, the one who becomes desireless. He has become desireless through this understanding of Vyavasthit that our Gnani Purush is giving us. Und das ist ein subtiler Punkt von demjenigen, der ohne Wünsche geworden ist. Er ist wunschlos geworden durch dieses Verstehen, was uns der Gnani Purush hier gibt. Yeah, the, the, uh, to to identify with the desire is the desire, see. Sich mit dem Wunsch zu identifizieren, das ist der Wunsch. See, ist der Jesse has desire, Christina has desire. Why do you say I have desire? Jesse hat, hat einen Wunsch, eine Begierde. Christina hat einen Wunsch, eine Begierde. Warum sagst du, ich habe diesen Wunsch, ich habe diesen Wunsch? Yeah. And there is nothing wrong with that appreciation. There's absolutely nothing wrong with that appreciation. Yes, I am aware of the desire of this person uh, is where 
you become free. I'm aware of his or her desire. Because it is really, you know, when you look at this paragraph, it is really magnificent. I mean, you know, it is, it is now, now we focus on that desire. Uh, if he didn't have the desire to sit a little longer in that garden, he wouldn't be worried about accepting the, you know, he would not have any, any problem with the man says, leave, the park is closing up, leave, or something, you see. It's we we in fact we continue to learn at the feet of the Sajivan Murti, the living one. See, uh, the living one within us all is really lifting us up now. Uh, the living one within us all is lifting us up all now as we look at these very subtle shades of scientific circumstantial evidences in life. You know. hmm? And this last sentence in this last paragraph about when you say somebody, when you curse somebody in your mind, you bind karma, uh, that as you all know by now is only for non-Mahatmas. Now, uh, this... chat from Guy. Yes. So, Susanne, can you say it? I've seen this chat. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Sudha, there's a question from Guy. Uh, is Guy's analyzation of his thoughts an interference of the Avastit? Is uh, the anal das Analysieren der Gedanken, also Guy's Analysieren seiner Gedanken, ein Einmischen in the Avastit? Is Guy's analyzation of his thoughts an interference of the Avastit? Mm -hmm. Is Guy's analysis and further entering into thoughts an interference of the Avastit? It is an interference if you believe that you are doing the thinking and if if you are aware that guy is doing the thinking and the analyzing, then it is not no longer an interference. Hmm? So they say, it is an Einmischen when you believe that you do the thinking, the thinking makes, the thinking makes. And when you know that guy the thinking has, then it is not an Einmischen. The nature of the prakrutis are so many different. If some some prakrutis never go, never think deeply, and some prakrutis do a lot of thinking. They simply cannot do anything more than just think. <laughs> <laughs> The, uh, uh, some people, you know, they get so lost in their thinking that they cannot do anything and others will say, enough, let's just go do it, let's just do it. So these are all Prakrutis, uh, the one who has arisen and is the knower or the Prakruti is, is never interfering into the Prakruti. He thinks he is interfering but he is not interfering. He thinks he is interfering, but he is really not interfering. Okay, also, um, der, der Wissende des Prakrutis, der, der das Prakrutis, der, der, der da aufgestiegen ist, der Wissende des Prakrutis, der kann sich nicht 
einmischen. Der denkt vielleicht, dass er sich einmischt, aber er kann nicht ein, sich nicht einmischen. Uh, so he may, he may feel like I have interfered. The, when there is interference, there's a very interesting uh, practical uh, thermometer, like uh, a sign of interference. And that sign is the disappearance of bliss, uh, the disappearance of harmony and bliss, which is a very big sign that you have interfered in Vyavasthit. You have become guy. Also er mag so, zu der Begann, er mag denken, dass er sich eingemischt hat. Aber es gibt ein interessantes, praktisches Thermometer, ein, ein, ein Zeichen dafür, dass man sich wirklich eingemischt hat. Und dieses Thermometer ist dieses Verschwinden der Glückseligkeit, das Verschwinden der inneren Harmonie. Und das ist ein sehr deutliches Zeichen davon, dass man Yes, uh, too much analysis of what is happening is the role of the intellect and it by nature will drag you away from this beautiful vision of who you are and who everybody is. And so there is a little bit of a red signal there, guy. Uh, there is a little red signal there and you, you know, when you mention that is there interference of Vyavasthit, interference in Vyavasthit, uh, you know, that is where you come very close to that red line. Hmm? Also, um, zu, zu viel analysieren ist uh, die, die Rolle des Intellekts und um, ja, der kann dich davon wegbringen, von dem da ist so ein kleines, äh, eine kleine rote Ampel, äh, sagt so da so geil. Also ein bisschen rote Ampel, hier vorsichtig zu sein, mit zu viel Analyse. Yeah, so the simplest, simple way of getting out of it is to a little conversation with Guy and say, Guy, yes, you did a lot of thinking about this and this, but did you see their Shuddhatmas? Did you see their pure souls? And so again, all of a sudden everything will kind of come back to baseline. Our baseline is Vyavasthit and Shuddhatma. Vyavasthit and Shuddhatma, see? Hmm? Und da ist ein ganz einfacher Weg, da wieder rauszukommen. Und das ist, äh, mit Guy zu sprechen und zu sagen, hast du die reinen Seelen der anderen gesehen? Du hast da viel analysiert, aber hast du ihre reinen Seelen gesehen? Und dann kommst du wieder zurück zu den the uh, yes and okay so uh, I know by the way guy is here in in Florida with me so I'll catch up and finish with him uh, and and do some more satsang with him maybe before he goes back to uh, New York um, Nebenbei bemerkt ist der Guy uh, in Florida, in der Nähe von Schuda oder bei Schuda und er wird mit ihm nochmal uh, zusammenkommen und nochmal ein bisschen Satsang mit ihm machen, bevor I, Guy wieder zurückgeht nach New York. I, I want to share you a very interesting story and I hope we don't run out of time, but here this is an interesting story of Dada, the real life example of, of Dada when he was, he, he was in a bus with 35 other Mahatmas he was taking to Nepal. All of them driving all the way from uh, Baroda to Nepal. Da gibt's uh, Shuddha möchte uns noch eine interessante Geschichte erzählen von Dada. Und damals fuhr er in einem Bus mit 35 Mahatmas von Baroda nach Nepal. And it has something to do with this last line. Uh, 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 you know, it's the last line of the satsang that we read today, and I'll come back to it. But they decided to that, that they decided to leave in rainy season. So you know how roads can become really muddy and with heavy rains, and sometimes you cannot. The road will be covered with water, and so Dada was going in, with with the Mahatmas, and all of a sudden the driver uh, they cannot even see the road. 
it's covered with water all around water 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 and we don't know whether they didn't know whether to go or not and es hat was zu tun mit dieser letzten mit diesem letzten satz den wir vorhin gelesen haben und schon dann wird darauf zurückkommen also sie sind in der regenzeit losgefahren und das ist wirklich da ist so viel regen dass man also dass die straßen sehr schlecht werden die werden voller schlamm und manchmal sind sie völlig bedeckt mit wasser so dass man gar nicht mehr sieht ob da eine straße ist und das ist ihnen damals passiert so they uh, they uh, they all ask they all come to dada dada what shall we do <laughs> do we go take the bus in the water or do we go wait you know can't wait until the water comes down so we can see where we are going so dada walks up to the front of the bus and talks to the driver and says uh, well, what do you think and and the driver looks at dada and he says because you see everybody in the bus was half would say no 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 you can't go and half will say go 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 because everybody wants to reach their uh, place in the evening where they're going to stay everybody is tired in the bus okay so uh, 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 spricht mit dem Fahrer ähm, und sagt, ja, die eine Hälfte, die will fahren, die wollen gerne zum Hotel kommen, die wollen gerne äh, ihr Zimmer haben, also essen, übernachten und die andere Hälfte sagt, äh, sind sehr müde und die andere, sagt, die andere Hälfte sagt, oh, wir sollten nicht weiter gehen. Und jeder so, ist müde. So the driver replied, I think I can, yeah, I think we'll be fine. So the other says, go. I mean, so the bus went literally into the water for, for, for its, what seemed like quite some time, everybody holding their breath, and they managed and came out on the other side okay, all right? And the driver said, yeah, this will be okay, and the driver said, okay, then go on. And the driver is then actually going through this water and and then two or three days later the same thing happened again and this time the water wasn't as bad at all really the water wasn't bad and everybody thought that's not a big deal the race driver who went through so much water this wouldn't be a problem at all it looked like a little bit of water only so again he the, 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 so the drive yeah. okay. <laughs> sorry <laughs> sorry sorry später waren sie an einer anderen stelle und da war wieder wasser aber es war bei weitem nicht so viel wasser wie beim ersten mal und jeder dachte na ja das hat das letzte mal das hat er ja geschafft also wird das ja jetzt keine große sache sein and then that, but he stopped he didn't go and so that again that went to him and says brother what is it that you see what do you think dada would speak to him very nicely brother what do you think and so he says dada we shouldn't go this time he says dada we shouldn't go so dada turn around and says okay looks like we'll have to spend the night on this side of the river uh, and everybody started saying all oh, all this and dada but look at you you know it's just this much so dada turned to all the mahatmane says he is not saying not to go vyavasthit is showing him not to go vyavasthit is telling him not to go he is not saying no don't get angry with the driver vyavasthit is telling him not to go you see it's sort of beautiful you know and so they this is a live example also es war dieser weniger Wasser, aber der, der Fahrer hat angehalten. Und Dada ist nach vorne gegangen zum Fahrer und sagt, Bruder, was ist es jetzt diesmal? Was denkst du darüber? Und Tuda erwähnt, dass Dada immer sehr nett mit dem Fahrer gesprochen hat. Und der Fahrer, Moment, mit Adventure der Fahrer sagt, wir sollten nicht weiterfahren. Ähm, okay, sagt, Dada dreht sich um und sagt zu den Atmas, es sieht so aus, als ob wir heute hier auf dieser 
Plusseite bleiben mussten. Und dann sagen die Leute, ja, aber da, da, letztes Mal ging es doch auch. Und dann sagt da, da zu den Bahnpass, es ist nicht er, der Fahrer, der sagt, wir sollen nicht fahren. Es, wir, es ist ja was Tit, das sagt, fahrt nicht. And you see, interesting thing is, later on in the, uh, in the place where they were staying, like the um, rest homes, rest houses, guest houses, they were there staying. They got the news from the buses that went ahead on that shallow water road and couple of them got stuck. They couldn't move this way or this way with passengers in it uh, because of heavy mud, very heavy mud. Uh, so this is how it is, understanding Vyavasit and uh, live examples of Dada. Uh, this is deeply described in, in that Jatra to Nepal, the, the, uh, the pilgrimage to Nepal. Mm. Und das äh, Interessante ist, später äh, haben sie in dem Gasthaus, äh, da wo sie übernachtet haben, erfahren, dass andere Busse, die gefahren, weitergefahren sind in diesem scheinbar nicht so schlimmen Wasser, stecken geblieben sind und zwar aufgrund von sehr viel Schlamm und da waren Passagiere in den Bussen. Ja, und so, so ist das gelaufen, das ist ein Beispiel für Virastin und das ist beschrieben äh, in dieser Geschichte über die Yatra nach dem So, I, we have learned a lot at the feet of our Gnani today. We, uh, as Susanne, over Nada and Shuda offer you our highest namaskars. We are extremely grateful for all of your to be present in this satsang. Uh, please accept our namaskars. Hmm? We have also heute sehr viel gelernt. Shuda, Uwe, Nada und Susanne, we thank you for your presence and for this gemeinsam satsang. Bitte akzeptiert unsere allerhöchsten Namaskars. Thank you, Jayasuda and Sachidan. Thank you. Jay Sachidan. Jay Sachidan. Jay Sachidan. Jay Sachidan. Jay Sachidan. Klaus, Jay Sachidan. I know Klaus doesn't understand. Helmut, Doris, Svenja, Rudigard. Yeah. Shudat Mavagwan, all of you. Yes. Jay Sachidan. <laughs> Jai Sachidan. Jai Sachidan. Uwe, you want to say something to them, please? Just, you know, you, it's yours now. Jai Sachidan. Like, I, I know there's not much, much to say. I'm just it's happy that it worked out. Yeah. Finally. Mm -hmm. And it looks, looks not too bad. And I think it's nice to, to How was it for Shuda? It was fine. It is. It is very, uh, it's very good. It's a little different, <laughs> different in the sense that you have all of this, uh, you know, Mahatmas and then the faces, but there is so much more beauty in the words of Dada that our attention is focused on and therefore it always kind of takes us away from this initial impact, you know, of oh, oh, Mahatmas here, you know, but it's always nice to be with Mahatmas, yes. Yes. So you liked it? Yes, I liked it. <laughs> we, we, can, we can do the, the experiment again. Yeah, yeah, we can. We continue. Let's see what everybody says. How did Susanna liked it, right, Susanna? For you, Anna, was okay, so? Yeah, schön. Yeah. Was okay for you, Anna? Very good. Very good. Yes, the, the sound is good, right, Tobias? The sound is. Yes. The sound is. Yeah. Mm hmm. Jesse, how was it for you? Very nice. Mm. Very nice. Mm. And Klaus? No, for me it was good for Klaus. I don't for garbage. And I think it's also if you know, this is how our Vyavasit is unfolding. Uh, so that we can be closer together and also be, be, learn to move away from our relative self, you see. Not to be too concerned about these images and focus more and more in t inside, but it always helps to be, this is next best thing to be to the live satsang, right?
Yes. Yeah. 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 Namaskar. Ayes namaskar. Bhutina Jai Sachidanand Shudatma Bhagwan. And we all send very positive signals to our dear, dear uh, Su- Suzanne from Lindau, who is going to have surgery. And Utah as well. And, and of course, Utah always. Yes. All of the energies are always there. So may they, may they remain as the self and see these evidences as they unfold. Huh? Yes. Yeah. All right. So. Jai Sachidanand. Hmm? Jai Sachidanand. Jai Sachidanand. Jai Sachidanand. Jai Sachidanand. Nice. Well, yes, it's five, five, five. Everybody five. Everybody five. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. Yes, yes, yes. Wonderful. Yes. some firecrackers from Klaus. <laughs> All right. Next time, Nara will put a lot of animations there. <laughs> yes. Bye. Bye, bye. Okay. Bye. Jai Sachidana. Jai Sachidana. Jai Sachidana. Jai Sachidana. Tschüss, Herr Chidana. Tschüss, Herr Chidana. Tschüss, ihr Lieben. Tschüss. Tschüss.